Hello and welcome to this video. In this video, I'm going to demonstrate uh, the location feature that's used by the London Tube Status Android app. Uh, so London Tube Status app is used to display the uh, London Tube lines and their statuses. And it will, it will also show the, uh, um, the nearest station uh, 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 where, the is, uh, uh, where the device is located uh, and the trains arriving or scheduled or on that station. So the location feature is used to um, uh, get the nearest tube station and uh, the list of trains arriving on that uh, on the station. Uh, while collecting this, uh, while collecting the location, it doesn't store uh, the, the device location in any of the external uh, storage uh, devices. It's only stored in memory of the of the device um, uh, while using the app. Um, let me quickly demonstrate on uh, the uh, the application, the usage, and uh, the location feature that's been used. So uh, this is the Android emulator. Since this is one of the uh, criteria to uh, publish the app, uh, uh, I have uh, I'm showing um, uh, this demo on the on the local environment uh, and in the Android emulator. So uh, the app. Uh, uh, is already installed. It's London Tube Status app, and uh, once the app is open, it shows the splash screen, and then it um, shows the list of lines and their statuses. But along with that, it also shows the disclaimer or the alert, where um, uh, it says that you know it's collecting the location data uh, to enable the nearest tube station uh, feature, uh, and it is collected in the background and when the app is in use. Yeah. So um, the first screen you see is you have two tabs, one London Tube and About Us. These are the main tabs. We are in the London Tube tab. And then there are a sub tab, uh, Tube Status and the next tube. Uh, the Tube Status, as I said, uh, a list of lines uh, and the name and the statuses of the uh, uh, London Tube. The next tab is where the location feature is used. Uh, in uh, uh, To find the, uh, the nearest station, uh, of the where the device is located mm, and then it uh, it will show the list of uh, trains scheduled on that station so when you click on the next tube uh, it should ask for the consent whether uh, uh, the device location can be accessed um, uh, so uh, you can click while using the app or only for only this time so once the app has the consent to access the location uh, it will try and find uh, the nearest tube station um, that uh, the, where the device is located and it will show the list of the lines uh, for that station and the trains that are scheduled uh, on, on the station. So say for example this is a circle line eastbound and westbound and when the trains are arriving. So this is where the location feature is used um, uh, to, to get the functionality or to for the app application functionality to show the uh, to sh or to get the nearest tube station. Thank you. Bye.